What's up guys? Oftentimes we get asked in the tech department at Racepack is, what is what's up with the license keys and how do I install them on my computer? Well, if you have a V300, a V500, or G2X Pro, you're gonna have custom license keys in a config file which come on a USB thumb drive when you purchase your unit. Now, even if you purchase it used from somebody, you're always gonna wanna make sure you get your license keys from the, that person, whether they give it to you on a separate thumb drive or they email them to you or something because you still need to install it because they're sensitive to each data logger and you need to make sure that uh, you have them in order for your data logger to work. So, how do I use it? Let's show you real quick and uh, get these babies installed into our DataLink 2 software. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to uh, take your USB stick that was provided and stick it into your computer. And when you do that, you're probably going to get this screen right here, which is your license key folder and your computer automatically recognizing the fact that you're plugging something in because they think it's a digital camera or something. But for our case, you're going to want to go ahead and close this out. And then from there, after you've installed your Datalink 2 software, you're going to go ahead and open up the Datalink program, which looks a little blank, but we're going to fix that here in a second. So basically the steps are you're going to want to go up here to your security setting at the top and you're going to click on read license disk and when you do that it's going to ask you which items you want to copy into your laptop so you're going to want to make sure you check all three of these boxes because you're going to need your registry keys your configuration file and your license keys so once you click that you're going to go ahead and click OK this box is going to ask you where is it that you want to pull this information from is it, do you want to search your whole computer? Do you want to use a CD-ROM or a removable drive? In this case, because it's on a USB drive, you're going to go ahead and click removable drive because it already sees it in your computer and you're going to click OK. As you click OK, you're going to see a message log pop up that says done. That basically means all of your stuff is already installed. And if you want to click on the details, it'll show you exactly what it did. You're going to go ahead and click OK, and from there you're basically all set to use your V300, V500, or G2X Pro. So, to make sure that it worked, we can go over here to click File, Open Car Configuration. In this particular case, I loaded the V300 6224. I'm going to go ahead and click OK, and just like that, I have my data logger config and everything needed in order to use my, my new V300. So, just like that, it's uh, pretty much a snap in order to install your race pack licensing keys. But just remember, like I said, if you have a used data logger that you've purchased, you're always going to make sure that you need some sort of licensing keys. If they've lost it and they didn't give it to you when you purchased your data logger, you can always give us a call at race pack and we can recreate them and send them to you via email or on a USB thumb drive. Other than that, if you have any other questions, please be sure to log on to racepack.com or check us out on our YouTube page at Racepack Media.